YouTube, what is good? Welcome back to another video. We are gonna talk about the different tail options on a hot shot setup. We're gonna talk about the benefits, what makes more sense for you to choose for your operation doing hot shot. We've never done something like this before, so we're about to get this done, man. Stay tuned and let's jump right into the video. Alright guys, so we are here with Leroy from Happy Trailers in Waco, Texas. He's going to talk to us a little bit about the specs on these ramps. We're going to talk about the pullout ramps on a straight deck trailer. It's what I've been using, it's what I've used since I started Hot Shot, which are the 8 foot pullout ramps. They're going to be located right in the back of the trailer. So it is nice that they pull right out the back. Uh, you don't have to lug them around from the side or anything. As Tim mentioned, they're 8 foot long. They're fully built on a 3 inch channel. They have a weight capacity per ramp at 5,000 pounds. So you're somewhat limited in the, the capacity as far as how much you can load up on right. these ramps. But they do have a nice easy loading. And that's why y'all have seen me. The most I've kind of done with these trailers are vehicles, pickup trucks, SUVs, and things like that. Nothing too crazy. There is a few farm equipment that you can get on and off here just depending on how the wheelbase is. But if you're starting out and you can't really get to say the hydraulic dovetail this is still not a bad setup to start with you can definitely do you know some work with this step up from pullout ramps if you're not looking to go that option if you want more options as far as freight that you can haul on the gooseneck trailer is gonna be your standard monster ramps Leroy again tell me a little bit about the monster ramps tell me why this is something I might want to move on to from having the sure. uh, pullout ramps your monster ramps are gonna be set up on a five foot dovetail so when you flip over the ramp you end up having a ten foot long ramp right for obvious reasons you have a lot more ramp that you can hit, so you're not going to have to be worried too much about if you're going to miss the ramp or, or not. Yeah, well, I go through that all the time. That's, that's super nice. <laughs> Plus, they're, they're rated 12,000 pounds per ramp, so really whatever the trailer's going to be able to handle, the ramp's going to handle. You don't have to worry about that. That's And that's huge, man. Going from just being able to say, okay, 10K is what I can put on the pullout ramps, you know, having this option definitely is huge. So way more options as far as free that we can get on the trailer. Now, one thing that I do know, and you know, we all know with the uh, with the dovetail is you have a lower clearance. So of course you're gonna have instances where you have to be real cautious where you may just bottom out. So keep that in mind. If this is something that you're gonna go with, be real cautious of places that you, you know, roads you take, tracks or railroads, that you, just keep in mind that you might hit something. You know what I'm saying? So right. great option if you wanna haul more vehicles, more farming equipment and things like that. Okay, put your back into it, babe. Hands up. <laughs> the other thing these ramps can do is if your equipment comes back too far where they can't flip back over onto the trailer, you've got this option to lock them in place right there and turn it into a stand up ramp. So, this is safe to be in transit. That's like correct. Okay. This is a I've, also, I've always wondered, I've seen this where you see a vehicle that might be, you know, a little further back and then they have the ramps right there. So, okay. Absolutely. One step more reversal. Yeah. All right, fam. Check this out, man. We have partnered with Happy Trailer Sales, your one-stop shop for all your trailer needs. They offer PJ trailers of all types throughout their seven and still growing stores in Texas. Not only do they provide a ton of accessories and upgrades, they have a wide variety of flatbed trailers, dump trailers, utility trailers, and more focusing on the customer experience. They offer rent-to-own options, equipment financing, and trailers.
trailer rentals. Check them out on Google for yourself and witness their excellent reviews. Get $500 off your next trailer by using the code MAC500. All their contact information will be in the description below. Now let's get back to the video. Next, we have the Powertail. Similar to the Monster Amps, but it's one complete piece. I'm gonna let Leroy talk to us a little bit more about that. As you can see, instead of two pieces with about you know four inches in between the ramps, this is all one piece. And then down below here, you'll see the cylinder poking out. This thing operates the exact same way as the monster ramps do, but instead of having to lug the weight of those monster ramps by yourself, you just push a button. This thing is gonna flip up onto the ground for you, and then push the other button, and it'll flip right back up. That's that's pretty convenient. You know, if you're out there, you're not trying to do too much work, you know, depending on you know where you're at to age, if you're hot shot and you're a woman or a female, you know gives you that option it's nice you know however it's electronic so just keep in mind that it's an extra thing that you do have to pay attention to an extra thing that you do have to maintain and take care of this is the power tail one other thing to keep in mind what i spoke about earlier is the clearance now you have something a little bit lower the cylinder that actually moves the piece of uh, equipment so that's something to keep out man just another option for you guys Hydraulic dovetail is what we're gonna talk about last. You'll see a lot of these on the road, man. Very convenient. They're good on clearance, uh, so to speak. But, of course, we're gonna let Leroy, the man of the day, tell us a little bit more about the hydraulic dovetail. Why would someone want to choose this option sure. you know, for hot shot trucking? This hydraulic dovetail is also 10 foot long, so you really get the same load clearance and load angle that you do with the monster ramps because you have a 10 foot tail. Yes. Um, what this allows, like you mentioned, is ultimate clearance. You definitely don't have to worry about your tail dragging on a hydraulic dovetail. This bumper tucks up underneath the trailer as the tail comes down. You've got that knife edge rear. It really is ultimate for loading. Um, and you've got the same load capacity as you do with monster ramps with the added advantage of being able to lift up the tail even with some weight on it. You have two five inch cylinders underneath the tail that help you lift up, say it was a, a skid steer or a tractor or say something with low, low ground clearance. Right, right. Um, where you're not gonna make it over that hump, get it on the tail pick it up all right y'all that's gonna wrap it up for this video just wanted to show you guys real quick the different tail options um for hot shot trucking again major thanks to leroy here with happy trailers for giving us this opportunity if you guys are in the area or if you guys are in a complete other state and are in need of uh equipment a trailer whatever it is dump trailers goosenecks uh car hauling Whatever it is, man, this is the guy to see. They'll take care of you. But anyways, man, we're gonna wrap it up. Like this video. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.